Hello everyone. In today's class, we are going to solve 8th Maths Kalika Chetri ke learning outcome number 12 and learning sheet number 46. Here 12.4 is type of triangle based on measure of angles. Here the first triangle is, see here, all angles are less than 90 degree, then it is called acute angle triangle next is in this triangle one angle is 90 degree so we call as a right angle triangle next in this triangle one angle is more than 90 degree so we called as obtuse angle triangle here explain the type of triangle based on the measurement of sides Earlier we just discuss about triangle based on angles. So it should be angle. Here is the first triangle is less than 90 degree. Angles are less than 90 degree. So we write acute angle triangle. Next here also all angles are less than 90. So we write acute angle triangle. And here, see here it is 90 degree. So we write a right angle triangle. Here also from wall it is 90 degree. We write here right angle triangle. And here it is more than 90 degree. It is more than 90 degree. So we write obtuse angle triangle in this figure triangle is not clear so we move to next one here is Bermuda triangle Bermuda triangle is acute angle triangle and this one is 90 degree so we write right angle triangle 12.5 write the points discuss earlier here is first acute angle triangle we have to define and give one example with figure so first we write definition an acute angle triangle is defined as a triangle in which all of the angles are less than 90 degree and we draw a example like this right angle triangle a right angle triangle is a triangle that has one of its interior angles are equal to 90 degree and here is the example. Next, obtuse angle triangle. An obtuse angle triangle is a triangle in which one of the interior angle measures more than 90 degree. Here is the example of obtuse angle next we go to 12.6 type of triangle based on measure of sides in this triangle all sides are equal so we say that it is equilateral triangle in next figure only two sides and two angles are equal then we can say it is isosceles triangle in this figure all sides are different or not same so this type of triangle we call as escaline triangle here i am a triangle my three sides are equal in the figure it is shown that three sides are equal to each other the three angles are equal to each other name me so three sides are equal means equilateral triangle so we write here equilateral triangle next observe the triangle draw equilateral triangle of different measurements in the following table here should be right in next figure it is right uh, draw means it is different to measure uh, with compasses like that we just write okay you just draw a triangle like this with the pencil and scale we, here we have to show three sides are equal so we 
right 5 cm on each side we label as PQR equilateral triangle means all sides are equal so we write 5 cm 5 cm and 5 cm next isosceles triangle I am a triangle my two sides are equal and also angles opposite to equal sides are also equal name me two sides are equal then it is isosceles triangle observe the triangle write isosceles triangle of different measurement in the following table here we have to write a triangle just draw tri a triangle like this here we draw a triangle in this we have to show two sides are equal so here 5 cm and 5 cm means it is two sides are equal and one side are, is different and we label as D E F next Esclen triangle I am a triangle my three sides are not equal to each other name me it is Esclen triangle observe the triangle write Esclen triangle of different measurements in the following table so just we have to draw a triangle with different measurement here the measurement is 6 cm and it is 5 cm and 3 cm so it is a scalene triangle here one statement is given the sum of three interior angle in a triangle is 180 degree 12.8 find the value of x in a given figures here one example is given we have to find the value of x here it is 90 degree so we write here 90 degree first we write x plus 90 degree plus 30 degree is equal to the sum of all three angles of the triangle is 180 degree we add these two it is 120 take 120 to this side it will become minus 120 180 minus 120 is 60 degree so the x value is 60 in this figure we start from x x plus 110 plus 30 is equal to 180 add this to it is 140 take 140 to this side it will become minus 140 subtract these two 180 minus 140 is 40 so the x value is 40 so this is the activity sheet number 46 in next class we solve 47 don't forget to like subscribe share our channel thanks for watching